Hey YouTube, Michigan Prepared here again. Listen, uh, got a few things I want to go over. Um, New York and other states, along with FEMA, are preparing people for nuclear attack. Um, New York just recently set, sent something out to its citizens. Uh, basically, like a how-to guide or something like that. I don't know. But uh, this isn't the first... <clears throat> excuse me the first time i've heard of it and uh that should that should concern you and uh i don't know if you've watched my other videos but i've posted uh photos of uh iosat tablets and apple pectin uh, both things can help you in the event uh uh you know a nuclear attack uh happens along with new york and other states preparing for uh, nuclear attacks um, I don't have an article on it I've been trying to find something on it <clears throat> I don't know if uh, they're trying to keep it quiet and out of the news or what but there's several several other people I follow on YouTube that are uh, talking about um, there's a dirty bomb being tracked by the Pentagon throughout New York uh, take that with a grain of salt I don't know how true that is uh, but if that's the case um, I mean, with our southern borders being open, it's not uncalled for, or, uh, it's not, how do you say it, it's not, uh, it's not too far-fetched, is what I meant to say. Um, sorry, distracted. Chicken cam. Anyway, so yeah, apparently there's being a... Uh, a dirty bomb being tracked in New York and uh, I don't know how serious it is I don't know how big it is I don't even know if there's any truth to it again that's what I'm hearing that's what a lot of people on uh, other YouTube sites are reporting um, let's see there's a list of cities and places most likely uh, to be first attacked in some sort of nuclear attack uh, one of the major cities, obviously New York, uh, um, they're talking about hitting the Pentagon, uh, Camp David Military Base in Maryland, uh, Maryland, Fort Ritchie in Maryland, and McClellan Air Force Base in California. So if you guys are in any of those areas, I would highly suggest uh, stocking up on uh, some IOSAT tablets. And some apple pectin. Again, I'll post some more photos of what that stuff looks like uh, so you guys can look for it. Uh, I bought all my stuff on Amazon, so you guys might be able to do the same. Sorry about that. But guys, this, uh, this stuff is no longer a joke. Take it for what it's worth. I'm hearing about cyber attacks at, uh, everywhere. Three here in the U.S., one up in Canada, actually two up in Canada, and uh, I guess there's there's some happening over in Europe and uh, other places. You guys really need to take this stuff seriously. Um, it's not going to stop anytime soon, and uh, it's only going to get worse. It's getting worse by the day. Again, my ugly butt. I don't like being on camera, but again, my motto is, if I can save just one person and, uh, or, or help one family, whatever, then I've done my job. Um, there's a bunch of U.S. government websites, including FEMA, putting out information on where to go, what to do. Uh, in case of a nuclear attack and these are uh, they're becoming more and more common which if you're not paying attention you really need to and the fact that FEMA and uh, the government websites are putting out all this information um, that should scare you a little bit not that I want to scare you and not that I'm trying to fear monger it's just information that I'm getting that I'm bringing to you guys uh, to help better prepare yourselves. I would highly suggest going out, stocking up on food. 
uh, if you can if you can find it um, um, get some IOSAT tablets I'll try to post links in the description on what everything's about what it will what it will do for you um, maybe I'll uh, post a couple links uh, to some YouTube videos explaining exactly what it is somebody else that can better explain it than myself all I know is I have it and I'm ready and uh, I'm taking this stuff seriously if you can see behind me right there that little spot in between my windows those are two cameras I'm not playing I got cameras all over my house that's only two uh, over here along this side of my house is my driveway I got a couple cameras over there I have a couple over here I got a couple in front I have a few inside uh, let's see if I can get a photo of it or capture it um, that security door right there I just recently installed that also have one on the front of the house um, I don't have any bars on my windows as you can see but uh, that's okay because I'm ready in case somebody wants to come in once again guys the civil unrest Get ready for it. People are being robbed hand over fist. Cars are being stolen um, like crazy. The amount of stolen vehicles have gone up like you wouldn't believe. And uh, yeah, the people being followed home from grocery stores is unreal. Um, not so much here in my state uh, that I'm finding, but when I search for it on the web, you know, crime statistics and stuff like that, robbery is up. It's up sky high. It doesn't really specify what, but from other reports that I've seen on YouTube and uh, other stuff that I follow, and everything kind of coincides with itself that, yeah, people are being followed home from the grocery stores. People are being in, uh, assaulted inside grocery stores. So do your best to prepare, guys. Also, I got a question for you. Uh, as I'm trying to grow my channel, I know I keep talking about being prepared and stuff, but would uh, maybe on my next couple days off, uh, leave in the comments. Do you guys want to see kind of what I have going as far as uh, is my medical supply bag? You know, what, basically what I have in there right now. And uh, maybe my bug out bag, what I have in there right now. Uh, if so... <laughs> if that's something you guys want to see, I'll pull those out and uh, we'll go through them on the video together. And I'll explain why I got what I got or how much of this I have or how much of that I have. Um, and maybe that'll give you guys some ideas on, on certain things you guys should stock up on. Likewise, well, no, I ain't going to do all that. So never mind, disregard that. But yeah, the, uh, the medical bag and bug out bag. If you guys would like to see the contents of that or a couple little things maybe you guys should do to uh, get ready, prepare yourselves, let me know. Um, again, with the uh, Finland-Sweden thing, uh, Vladimir Putin has already warned, and this was like a week or two ago, has already warned him that, you know, if Finland and Sweden join NATO... Uh, I guess he, uh, Putin, uh, says that's an act of war, uh, or something. And, uh, just a couple days ago, Finland and Sweden basically did the paperwork to join NATO. They're not official yet, and I don't know how long it's going to take, but, uh, Russia and Putin are not happy about it. Um, that could spark nuclear war in a heartbeat. Um, he's already threatened uh, Finland that it, uh, and Sweden both that if they join NATO uh, that there would be severe repercussions. Well, just a few days ago they did the paperwork. Again, I'll put something on the screen. Uh, you guys can see that. Um, the New York thing, I get, you know, I'll post that on the screen. And the, uh, the list of cities that would most likely be attacked, I'll post that on the screen as well. Uh, but yeah, guys, get prepared. This isn't a joke. Um, 
again there was an expert I posted on my last video I left a link to uh, Canadian uh, Canadian prepper that's it I left a link to his channel where he's been talking with an expert on uh, basically a guy who's who predicted this war between Russia and Ukraine and in the latest video they were talking about what are the chances that we're going to go to nuclear war and this expert claims that 100% guaranteed and again I'm not trying to fear monger but I'm inclined to believe these experts that have deep intel I'm just some idiot youtuber truck driver trying to bring you guys the most current valid information that I can um, but I try to post links and articles to back up what I'm talking about uh, again guys take it with a grain of salt uh, do some research for yourself if you, if you need to if you don't believe what I'm saying but get prepared guys stock up on your beans and rice your cans your canned meats um, self-defense weapons uh, I don't care what you guys get just get something uh, some sort of uh, self-defense weapon um, stock up on your IOSAT tablets, your your Apple pectin, whatever. Uh, but get ready, guys. I don't think uh, it's going to be much longer, honestly. They keep talking about this war could stretch out for decades, but I don't think it's going to be decades. Um, all these countries keep pushing Russia's buttons, and Russia keeps pushing our buttons. And uh, I don't think it's going to be much longer, guys. more chicken cam for you love my little guys just getting ready these guys here will help keep me alive that one right there that one love that chicken chicken's awesome there's another one staring us down I don't know if you can see them in there right right there anyway Keep your heads on a swivel, uh, guys. Get prepared. Look up the information I'm bringing you. You'll find it just as I did. And uh, it's not a joke. Quit believing in your uh, liberal media because they're definitely not going to tell you what's going on. Um, stay safe, guys. Keep your heads on a swivel. And please do me a favor. Like, share, and subscribe. Uh, I'm trying to grow this channel. Trying to bring as many people this information as I possibly can. And I'm not going to be able to do it without your guys' help. So please, again, like, share, and subscribe. And uh, we'll holler at you later. Michigan Prepared out. Stay safe.